Hey, this video is going to be in response to a comment that I received about shooting Kevlar bulletproof material. I'm not really sure who it's from, you know who you are. About a 22 long rifle being able to defeat Kevlar. Well, today we're going to check that out on a personal level. I have a 22 long rifle Velocitor. It is probably one of the two most powerful 22 long rifles on the market. The other one would be the CCI Stinger, which is a reduced weight bullet uh, setting on an elongated 22 long rifle case. This is the Velocitor. It is full weight 22 long rifle. I think it's around 39 grains. It is a hollow pointed bullet and it does travel roughly 1650 feet per second, give or take, depending. Well, today I'll be shooting this out of Zachary's Henry 22 uh, model H001. It is a rifle, so it will have uh, full 22 long rifle power. And we're going to be shooting from a distance of around 10 to 15 feet into the Kevlar, which is a really battered, tore up, uh, been shot a few times. It is a ballistic insert for the U.S. military uh, for the Pathfinder uh, vest. And it usually goes around this area, protecting the hips and kidney area. And it is supposed to uh, defeat up to a nine millimeter submachine gun or lesser. So this is supposed to be actually less protective than a level two vest. All right, let's do this here. I'm gonna set this up by my bucket. I'm not gonna pin it to it this time, but I'm gonna set it right there just loosely. And we're going to go back here and see what happens. Like I said, I'm going to go back about, yeah, this looks like about 10 or 15 feet somewhere right in here. Pretty close range. Bear with me. I don't have a camera crew, so uh, I'll try to set this up as best as possible. I'll set it right there. We'll load up, take a shot, see what happens. Firing one time. Okay. As you can tell, the bucket, there is not even a deviation into the five gallon bucket, not even a dent. And here's the insert. Right there is the bullet. I got my finger on it. I should just be able to very simply push the bullet out. There it is. The back side of the bullet, as you can tell, it is uh, it is mushroomed quite nicely. There. 22 Velocitor into Kevlar. You see the Kevlar did its job. It expanded. And it effectively defeated the 22 long rifle at a very close range. Now, there you have it. Most people shooting 22 long rifles at you more than likely won't have a Velocitor. They'll just have some junk they bought from Walmart or something like that. This is Top Gun. Have a good one.